top temperatures, Jan and Sal. We are ready for it. Carol, thank you very much indeed. Gail, so Glad you're ready for it. <laughs> I'm not really. I'm not ready for it. Nobody's ready for it. Yeah. Uh, but I guess we need it, don't we? And it's about time. Uh, it's 7.53. Now, every musician's dream is to make a successful career from playing the instrument they picked up as a child. And cellist Sheku Kane Mason has managed to do just that. He learned to play at the age of six and has since, well, he's done everything, hasn't he? He's yes. won the BBC Young Musician of the Year. He performed, you'll remember, at the wedding of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. And last night, you might well have seen him, on the Strictly Results Show. We're going to speak to him in a moment. First, let's have a listen. I've been rocking in the same boat for the longest time Trying to turn these clouds into a rainbow Hoping all is fine In the storm Won't end When you think it's done It starts again That is Sheku performing with Zach Abel last night on the Strictly Results show. Morning. Good morning. Is there anything you can't do? <laughs> is there anything you can't play? I mean, that that oh, yeah. was amazing. Thank you. I mean, there's many things outside of cello that I can't do, <laughs> for sure. How yeah. did that collaboration come about? Um, I suppose quite, quite naturally we just became friends and started jamming together and then wrote this song about maybe a year and a half ago. Um, and yeah, it's really great to And how work much with of a departure like is that for you? To me, it feels it feels very natural. In in if I um, if I enjoy the music, enjoy the musicians that I'm working with, then whatever the style is, I think I can commit to that. I mean, it's quite extraordinary, really, isn't it, for for a cellist to be a star performer on big weekend shiny floor <laughs> mainstream prime time telly. I mean, you must feel I've I've done it. Uh, oh, um, I, I think I'll never feel that I've I've, I've really? done it in the sense that there's always. Um, pieces of music that I've yet to learn more, more than I can, I, I can explore. But I do enjoy moments like that, and it's, it's very special. And bringing the cello into people's lives, an instrument you love, in yeah. millions of people. I hope, yeah, I hope with performances like that I can inspire people to see this instrument as something they want to listen to or play. Do you ever slightly pinch yourself in moments like that? Like John said, you know, the big shiny floor show. Um, because we've seen you right from the start, really, haven't we? I know you started playing at six, but... Right from, was it Britain's Got Talent we first saw I you? Do, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And do you ever think, if I'd known then that, that it would take me down this road, I wouldn't have believed it? I certainly wouldn't have believed it, no. Um, but, yeah, I don't know. I, 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 I suppose I always, I don't know, I'm thinking about music a lot of the time and don't have so much chance to, to pinch myself, as you say, but it's, um, I enjoy every, every, every moment and it's, I feel very lucky to be able to travel and play. It's great. Well, the song we just, saw you with, with Zach on Strictly last night that's one of the songs on, on your new album which is, oh, we were just talking off, off air, uh, about the, the range of musical styles on that album is phenomenal, from, from classics going back hundreds of years to stuff like that that you've written yourself, I mean it, 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 it's everything there. Yeah and it's really nice to have put um, such a range together on an album and for me a big part of making this album was the collaborations that took place working with friends and musicians that I really, really admire, like, like Zach and uh, my sisters on the album. I have a friend um, who's a jazz pianist, a composer, and, um, and m many other things. And I think, yeah, working with these musicians together all on one album is very, feels very, very personal um, to me. People will have noticed. <laughs> <laughs> You've brought your cello with you this morning. Beautiful, Indeed. beautiful cello. Indeed. And you have a, a, a piece of music you're going to share with us this morning. Tell us about what you're going to play for us. Yeah, I'm going to play um, a song called Mavanui, um, which is a Welsh song, and that also, also features on the um, album. And it's a song that I grew up um, listening to. I spent most of my summers as a child in South Wales with my grandmother. And, and so, um, yeah, this song means a lot, a lot to me. Take it away. We can't wait to hear it. <laughs> Thank you.
beautiful. Oh. Absolutely Should we beautiful. Should we just stop now? <laughs> <laughs> we'll go home. Yeah, exactly. I just noticed, because... I don't know, because I never played the cello, but normally there's a kind of spike on the bottom. But yeah, I didn't want to damage your beautiful floor. Um, so <laughs> it's I, not beautiful. So, so, and also, also, it would take a bit of, of time to put that out. Oh, you know, I see. Your so. cello is rather more beautiful than our studio floor. Yeah. <laughs> 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 don't worry about this. Yeah. Oh, so you must have incredibly powerful, strong thighs. Oh, um, that's not a very heavy instrument, to be honest. Okay. Yeah. I bet that's a question you've never asked. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Not... We like to bring you the important things here on breakfast. <laughs> well, no, I was like, where's the needle thing? He's, he's just bouncing between the legs. That's incredible. Thank you so much for coming in. That was wonderful. <laughs> Thank you for, for cheering up. We needed that this morning. Thank you. We <laughs> did. And Sheku's new album is called Song. His single is called Same Boat. It's 7.59. We'll have the headlines coming up. I want to uncover the true Agatha Christie. She was an incredibly precocious child. She saw terrible things.